Yo, yo, what's up, everybody? So I actually am going to teach you a little bit about how to build your Instagram and your Facebooks. So um, first thing you have to understand, you don't have to have a massive social media following in order to be successful in this business. Okay, Does it help you? Absolutely. But you can do it the old school way of just calling people on the phone constantly all day long and sending emails and text messages. You can do it that way. Okay, You don't have to use your social media, but in most cases, you will accelerate at a much faster rate if you utilize your social media. So a lot of you, I know when you get into this business, you think like, I don't have a massive following. I don't have a lot of people to reach out to. Well, guess what? For those of us that do, guess how we got there? Guess we built it. Okay, we built those followings over years of work. Now, I have taken tons of courses on how to build your social media following over the years. Okay, I've spent thousands of dollars on this. And the number one most like productive things that I've ever come across are these things that I'm about to teach you right now. Like all the other stuff that I have seen and utilized was crap. Okay, this stuff right here that I'm about to tell you, this is money. Okay, so. And you can just imagine that for each person that you add to your team, that's going to give you or, or to your following. That's if you think about it, that has the potential of you growing even more through each person that you add, right? Because they're connected to people. And whenever you do certain things, they may share it with their following, which leads to exposure to hundreds or thousands of more people, right? So here's the first thing that you need to understand. Okay. Number one, you must be doing your three to one posts every single day. Okay. And the reason is because, um, you want your timeline to always show something that has something to do with CBD. Always. As soon as people click on your profile to check you out, they should know exactly what you're into. Okay. So make sure you're doing your three to one posts every single day. Okay. Otherwise this is not going to benefit you as much as it, sh as it should. Okay. So, um, so here's what, here's what you do. It's real simple. So the real uh, money, the, the real, the real way you're going to make your money in building your business, right? Your, your social media following is, is super simple. All you got to do is comment like a monster. Okay. And I mean like a monster. So everybody that you follow, everybody that you were in contact with, you leave a comment on their posts. Okay, so I'm gonna give you a little example and I'm showing you guys on my computer here because I can't show you this on my phone. So I wanna be able to show you like what I would be doing if I was sitting in front of my computer, but I do this on my phone all day long. Okay, so you would actually just hop on your newsfeed. This is my newsfeed right here. And this is actually Bob Proctor right here. Okay, so this is Bob Proctor. So I would actually, and Sandy Gallagher, they're super famous. So they have people that are all into mindset, business, success, and so forth. So what, all you gotta basically do is go click on this and, um, and just type something like this in there. I love this. Awesome, right? Go to the next one. Ooh, K-Swiss. I love me some K-Swiss. I love these shoes. So, boom. Comment. Here's another one. Here's one of our girls, Nicole Diaz. So she posted here. Woo, woo. So I would just leave a comment. Now, it doesn't even, this isn't going to help me really grow so much. I mean, it might because some, some of her followers might start following me too, right? Which is not really what I'm trying to do. But you know, this is basically basically giving her some social proof, right? It's making her posts look more important. Okay, so um, here's another one. We'll skip that one because that was posted in our Savage group. Okay, uh, here's another one. Uh, I would not post on this because it's a sugary drink, right? I wouldn't. I wouldn't uh, post. I wouldn't uh, post on that. Um, Alienware computers. I love Alienware computers. Okay, I love. Okay, love this. Right. So you just comment, comment, comment comment, comment. And then you do the same thing here on Instagram. So check this out. Okay. So go on Instagram and I actually already did this before you guys popped on here. Right. So what you do is you go in the search bar. So in the search bar, um, uh, on your phone, right. Or you can do this at uh, Instagram.com. You type in the hashtag, right. Let's type in the hashtag fitness, right. There's three hundred and fifty nine million posts that people have actually, um, used this hashtag. Okay. So we're going to click on that, which we're already here. Okay. I already did this a minute ago. And then you're going to look at, it's going to show you the top posts. Okay. And, um, and what you do is you just go in each one and you just leave a comment. So I would leave a comment like love, uh, like beautiful, beautiful shot, right? Super harmless. No big deal. 
It's mainly just to, to get my face in front of her people. Okay. And that's, oops, it's not that. Uh, shot. What the hell? The auto. What the hell's going on here? <laughs> Let's just hit post. Okay. Got it. Okay. So, and I'll just leave that there. Now check this out. And this is what happens on Facebook and Instagram. See how my name just popped up here? Now what's going to happen is, is when people click on this and they click on her thing, they're going to see my name. Now what's going to happen is if they, if they uh, like what I posted, right? Or even her. So even she may actually go click on my stuff now, right? And she's going to click on my profile, right? And then what is she going to see? What is she going to see? She's going to see me posting about entrepreneurship in this little workout video. She's going to see that I have actually uh, talked about CBD in this one, right? They're going to see a lot of C like a lot of fitness stuff. They're going to see all this stuff. And if she likes me, then what's going to happen is she's going to follow me, right? She's going to follow me. But the, on top of that, what's going to happen is too, is that her followers, right? Her followers see that I just left this comment. They're like, oh, who's this super, superhero strong fit guy? right? They're going to click on my profile. So let's say I want to click on her profile. I don't even know what she's saying right here. Some kind of weird language, right? And I'm like, oh, wow, right? I really like these photos. I like what she represents. Cool. I'm going to follow. Boop. Then they follow. This is how you get followers, people. It's as simple as that. So what you got to do is you just got to follow like a monster. I mean, uh, comment like a monster. Now, Another tactic that you could do as well, too, is when you find people that, like this chick, like I don't even know who she is. I'm going to unfollow her in a second. Um, but when you find people that you do like, right, go follow them because they're going to get a notification that is showing like, hey, you know, Damon's following you. Superhero Strong Fit is following you. And then what's going to happen is, is when they get that notification, if they're not following you yet, they may go actually check out your profile. And if they like what they see, they'll follow you back. Okay. And it all comes from first commenting. Okay. Comment, comment, comment. So I would actually go on her feed and I would comment on like her last three posts. Okay. Like literally her last three posts, I would go comment on them, blah, 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 blah. Like comment on them. Right. Same thing happens on your Facebook. So here's Raylene. She's a friend of ours. Okay. Um, uh, so I would post in there, get it. Right. So now all her friends and followers saw that as well too. Boom. There's my name. Right. And this is basically what you're doing. You're basically commenting like a monster. And this is going to lead to you getting more exposure and generating and piquing people's interests, which is going to make people want to um, check out your profile. Now, check this out on top of that. So on Facebook, here's a little trick on what you can do to grow your um, your following as well, too. So whatever you are interested in, fitness, motocross, Corvettes uh, Lamborghinis, moms, being a mom, being a parent, whatever you are interested in, whatever really makes your heart sing, you want to go because there's groups on everything you can imagine. Okay. So you go to the groups, right? And you want to search for groups. Okay. So, um, so here's some suggested ones, right? So let's just, let's just, let's go to this weight loss one. Let's see if they'll just let us right in without actually, um, having to answer any questions, uh, which is usually they have like a little questionnaire, right? And if you answer it, then they'll, you know, they'll let you in or they'll prove it after the admin approves it. So I actually can't get in there yet because they have to approve it. Um, so let's do this. Let's go to the ones I'm already in. So let's go, um, uh, let's search some of mine. I got a lot. Okay. I got a lot. Let's go to the keto go to the keto recipes. Okay. So let's go in here. So we're going to go in the keto recipes. Um, and let's say, um, let's, we'll just say, we'll just go in this group. So I'm going to say, this looks delicious, delicious. Right. And what's going to happen is people that are in this group, right. They're going to see my name and same thing's going to happen. They're going to click on my profile. If they like what they see, they're going to request to be my friend. Okay. And that, and that's basically what happens. So if you do this for say 30 minutes a day, an hour a day, where you just literally just straight, just go comment, 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 like a monster over and over and over and over again, basically throwing your name out there, right. And making yourself visible, you're going to start to get people who start to check out your profile and actually start to request you to be your friend or follow you. Okay. And that's going to increase your reach. 
And it's really like, it's really that simple guys. That's really, that's really all you got to do is comment, 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 and engage with people who comment on your stuff. Right? So for example, let's go to my page right now. So let's go to my page right now. So always engage with the people who engage with you on your posts and don't worry about it. Like if you make posts, right, this is one I just made a minute ago. If nobody comments on your stuff, like, don't worry about it. There's, there, there's people seeing it. Okay. Don't worry about it. They haven't commented yet, especially on like your CBD stuff. If people aren't commenting, don't worry. Here's the reason why they're not commenting on, on your CBD stuff. Okay. People still have that stigma that CBD is from marijuana. Right. So oftentimes when you post a CBD post, they're afraid to comment because they know their name is going to show up and then it's going to show up as that stigma. So then people are going to be thinking like, you know, that they're potheads and nobody wants to be viewed as a pothead. Right. So that's why it's important that you always talk about like, hey, this is from hemp, not marijuana. And um, and that, you know, we don't get you high. We get you healthy kind of thing. You got to be talking about that all the time. But check this out. So I just made this post a minute ago and. Um, you want to engage with people who do actually engage with you, right? So I made this post talking about like what my freedom number is. It's $100,000 a month, right? But really it's $400,000 a month, right? And then I had some people post below. So Ben popped in here. So oh, you, so this guy, I'm like, oh, you know, you got this, bro. You got this, bro. So, um, so I would engage. So you engage with the people who engage with you right? Who comment on your stuff. If they took the time to say something, you need to respond. Okay. So, um, so I will respond to these later, but that's basically what you want to do. Okay. So, and this is, this is why it's important. So when somebody clicks on your profile, right? So if you click on my name, what's going to happen is what you're going to see. Look right here in my jobs, I'm a CBD 50 K affiliate. Okay. Now I already have that boom right there is the first thing. Now they're going to scroll through. They're going to see me working out. I'm talking about entrepreneurship here, right? I got some more kind of, you know, what I like to call uh, my reality checks. Um, I got a little informational video here. See, when you're doing a three to one, you always want to add value, right? So you want to add value to people's lives. So that way they're paying attention to you. Okay. So, but anyway, I'll, I'll respond to these and say stuff to them, right? And this is why you want to make sure you do your three to ones. People should know right away what you're into and what you do when they click your profile. Okay. So do your three to ones every day, but that's really all you got to do guys. That's really all you got to do. You just gotta, you gotta post on your page every day. Okay. Comment like a monster, right? Join a bunch of groups. Like I'm like, I'm part of tons of fitness groups, right? And as I see those posts popping up, I'll just leave a comment or, answer people's questions, right? That are part of these groups. And sometimes I'll just go into those groups. I'll go search for them and go into them just so I can, right? Cause sometimes our Facebook algorithms don't show us, um, things we haven't, um, um, been, um, you know, commenting on or engaging with lately, right? Your Facebook only shows you the things that it thinks that you'll be interested in. Okay. So it's good. It's going to always show you that. So when you comment on certain things, it's going to start showing you more posts of those things. Right. So, um, so that's why it's another reason why it's important that you comment on like, so go in your friends list and go through alphabetically all your friends and just click on their last few posts and just leave a comment. Hey, I love that picture. All oh, your kids are so cute. Oh, that's so awesome. I'm so glad to see you're doing well, whatever post whatever, because it's also going to change up your algorithm. So Facebook starts to show you more of their stuff. Okay. So, um, so that's the real down and dirty on how you build your pages. It's actually really easy guys. It really is. It's really simple. It just comment like a monster and make sure that your, um, you know, that your, your timeline says something about CBD and what you're into. So that way when people click on your profile, they know right away what you do and what you're into. Okay. So, um, so anyway, so that's the real down and dirty on how you actually build your, your social medias. If you have any questions, feel free to hit me up directly and, uh, hope you guys have a wonderful day. Go do your three to ones and get to commenting. Talk to you guys later.